Hey everyone, welcome back to the course. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Flask, a web framework for Python. So, let's get started. Watch the previous videos to know about what is Flask. Step 1. Installing Python The first thing you need to do is install Python on your computer. To check if you have it already installed, open up a command prompt or terminal and type Python version. If you don't have it installed, you can download it from the official Python website. Just follow the instructions on the screen and you'll be good to go. Once you have Python installed, you can use pip, which is the package manager for Python, to install Flask. Open up your command prompt or terminal and type command pip install flask. This will download and install flask along with any dependencies that it needs. Now that we have flask installed, it's time to set up a virtual environment. A virtual environment is a way to create an isolated environment for your Python project. This allows you to have different versions of Python and packages installed for different projects without them interfering with each other. To create a virtual environment, open up your command prompt and type this command where vert is the name of your virtual environment. This will create a new directory with the name vert in your current directory. Now we need to activate our virtual environment. To do this, open vert directory and open cmd in that directory. On Windows, use this command to activate using source. This will activate your virtual environment, and you should see the name of your virtual environment in your command prompt. Our virtual environment is set up and activated. We can start creating a Flask application. Create a new file called app.py in your current directory and open it up in your favorite text editor. In this file, we'll start by importing Flask and creating a new instance of the Flask class. We'll also define a simple route that will return hello, world, when we visit the root of our web application. Make sure that you're in the directory where your app.py file is located and type flask run. This will start the development server and you should be able to visit your web application by going to the link provided in the terminal in your web browser. That's it. In this video, we went through the steps of installing Python, installing Flask, setting up a virtual environment, creating a Flask application, and running it. Flask is a powerful tool for creating web applications, and I hope this video has been helpful in getting you started. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. See you in the next